really dirty right here. Right there. So this place is an Airbnb and uh, definitely requires a desperate cleaning here. Because people come with, uh, with their shoes and all that. Last time you were here, probably a year ago, so they haven't had it cleaned for a year. And this is what you get. So, some stains, see the visible stains right here, there, there, and right there, over there too. So I'll just grab them with my stain remover. Let's see, sometimes they're not visible, but here. Uh, we can call them spots or stains. Okay. So this is what you call a detailed work. You gotta get rid of these stains. That's why we're a five star. We don't uh, rush the work. We work on spots and stains. Most of the spots uh, dis uh, like disappeared once I sprayed my pre-spray, but some of these uh, stubborn ones are left behind, right? So you can't do nothing about it until, unless if you, unless if you really give it a good uh, spot cleaning agitation here, you know. So. Now what I'll do is, I'll extract them. I'll extract again, so that way it's going to be perfect. Perfect. That's 
more like it now. So I do use a, a, a spot remover that's local here. So you gotta pick your uh, favorite spot remover if you're a professional. And then do what I just did right, now, right here so that way you can get, to, you know, like repeat business. So right here, you see this? And look at here. There's a lot of spots. It's been like over a year, as I said. All right, so these people haven't called because the place was busy. I'm, I'm guessing. That's why. It's an Airbnb right here another one the rest is good I checked okay that's the last two and we're done here there's like three rooms three rooms to clean here And it is really hot, I'm actually sweating. There's no AC right now. I'm just sweating like crazy. There you go. Let's rinse that properly. Yeah, it was really bad. I should have taken before. <laughs> That's just too bad. Because I'm rushing. We're very busy. I'm just rushing for the next guy. He's he's waiting already. That's one of the reasons I have no time to film. Good. This one turned out nicely too. And there's one over there. I don't want to walk. Anyway. So we've got some spots actually, it's just, these are spots, some over there, most likely it will come off with this one, and there's like that one, there's that one, I love my sprayer by the way, it's the work sprayer very inexpensive and spray is amazing I just had to uh, change the tip and I have let me see the tip here that's the size 6502 and uh, it doesn't doesn't leak either right eh? there's no there's no leakage from the tip anyway so let's go continue Yeah, it's gonna come out. 
because these are only spots. Stains are the ones actually. And sometimes the spots could be challenging as well. The carpet is needs cleaning. <laughs> then I'm gonna use my concrobium spot remover for challenging ones. That's also inexpensive, less than 10 bucks in Canada here, where I live. Now this is, uh, I do the tapping method mostly, because this thing is nylon. It's a nylon carpet. I don't want to ruin it or distort the piles. So you got to do the tapping method. That part was the worst. It's also bad. It's a cream color nylon. That's the difference right here. It brightened up very nicely. Yeah, it came very well. 